I saw somebody on the Vectorworks community trying to create this into a viewport with a crop. Now the answer is to go to advanced properties and then tick this option here and that will do it for you. If you want to cast shadows of removed objects for visualization purposes, that's also a cool trick to turn that on. Let's go OK. Let's then go back and edit the design layer. And here's the crop. So this is the crop that's been added, but you do have to come back to this and make changes to it to give you the view that you wanted. You can see I've got everything selected at the moment. So it puts a crop around everything, and now you just need to adjust it to give you the crop that you're looking for. So if you want to take half the building away, that's cool. You can do that. You want to cut through the building, that's great. Then you just return to the viewport and update. Let's go back and update. And now you can see there's my clip cube has now been embedded into my viewport. Hey, thanks for watching. Hey, if you like these videos, don't forget to give me a like. If you want to get better Vectorworks training, become part of my community. Every Friday, we've got catch-up classes to cover the topics we've covered during the week. And we also cover specific tools and techniques. So if you want to join me every Friday, become a member of my community. Take care.